Much of that poultry house destruction occurred in northeast Scott County and continued northwest into Winston County. Tyson, Food Report, Tyson Foods reports that its farmers alone lost 36 houses in the area. One Winston County poultry grower lost all eight of his poultry houses to the EF4 tornado. Charles Wilkes poultry houses once looked like these of a neighbor, all neat and tidy. It only took 30 seconds for an EF4 tornado to turn his eight chicken houses into splinters and wreckage. In fact, the tornado damaged or destroyed every structure on the farm, barns, sheds, and the Wilkes home. The Wilkes family heard it all from their storm shelter. Oh, we went out there probably four, five minutes to the hit. And then it got loud and the uh, top rolled back on the storm shelter. The Wilkes installed this steel storm shelter in the ground about 10 years ago after another tornado struck the property. They came inside of it, they bolted it down shut. The tornado hit, it obliterated the building that used to stand on top of this storm shelter and then it grabbed the corner of this steel hatch trying to rip it off. When we get our new house, the first thing that's going to be built is a basement so all of our family can get in town in it. Shortly after the tornado hit, the Wilkes received a phone call from a man who had found one of their check stubs miles away to the northwest. He said, you don't know me, but I live in Columbus, Mississippi, and I just walked outside my house and found your check stub, and I had to call and make sure you were all right. Surprisingly, the Wilkes cows and horses were unhurt by the tornado. Their insurance coverage will cover part of their losses. Once the debris from the poultry houses is buried, they plan to rebuild. We're going to build them back just as soon as we can get to repermit it, because they're going to be a little bit bigger houses. But we'll have to go through a repermitting process because they'll be bigger. As soon as we can get them built back, uh, get the permits back, we're going to build them right back. From Winston County, Mississippi, I'm Artis Ford reporting.